What we demonstrate here is the search technology, what we have introduced a couple of weeks ago. The key advantage is the noise vibration, what the tool has with a standard impact driver. And this is what I like to show you now. This is a 6x100 screw and what we will demonstrate is the sound pressure level on a standard impact driver based on this application. What you can see is the, the sound pressure le level is on 92 and you hear this also how much noise a standard impact driver is doing. So now we will compare this with the search technology. And you see a significant difference of 10 sound pressure level. And you hear this also, how less the noise level is on this tool versus a standard impact driver. It actually brings it down to a, a comfortable level, doesn't it? It's, Correct, yes. It's, uh, that means at that slightly you, higher level, it, it starts to hurt. You know? Even if you're working in close conditions like here, you're able now to use an impact driver instead of a drill driver. And the advantage is it's a small and compact tool versus a drill driver. And you don't have a back force like a drill driver when you use a quite or when you use in general an impact driver. Yeah, so that when you say it's surge technology, that's what it's called, yeah? Correct, yes. And so what's going on inside there's So inside you have a liquid, which means you have less friction between the metal. On a normal impact driver, what you see is that the metal on metal push and that's how you make the force. Yeah. Here you have a liquid, that's a oil which means you reduce not only the sound level, you also have a huge advantage on the durability because you have less material which is pushing each other. Does that give you as much impact as the old metal on metal or not? The impact is longer than the impact driver, which means you see on the 6x100 that you don't see any difference on the performance, but you see a big difference on the sound level. So the days of noisy impact drivers are numbered? Yes, especially for the general application where customers use up to 6x120, 180 millimeter. Yeah. It's a perfect tool, of course. If you need the more power, you still have the, quite, uh, the, the standard impact driver, which gives you more power for bigger applications as well. Yeah, I find on site that guys just use impact drivers for everything, whether they need them or not. They've just become their screwdriver now, haven't they, really? That's true, yeah, because as I mentioned, it's a smaller and, and more compact tool versus a drill driver. The runtime is higher and also you have less back force, which means if you use a drill driver in general, you always have a back force, which you don't have on an impact driver. So for, for fastening, an uh, impact driver is much better than a drill driver.